here's the long awaited how to go live on Gorilla Tag. So, first you want to open up like uh, whatever browser you have. If that's like Opera, Chrome, Microsoft Edge, whatever. And then you're going to go on here and type OBS. And I will also put a link in the description. So, if you can't find it, just go in the description. Um, here you're going to press Windows, and that's going to go ahead and install OBS Studio. So after you have downloaded OBS Studio, you should open it up, and it should look something like this. We still have to add like a display capture. So to do that, we're going to press the plus right here, add a game capture, name it whatever, and uh, then we're going to press capture specific window. Then we have to open up Gorilla Tag. And I forgot to mention, this only works on Steam, so... Alright, now when it's opened up, just go ahead and head back into OBS. Now you can press Gorilla Tag, so now you can do whatever you want, and it will only show the Gorilla Tag screen. You maybe also want to add a text on the screen, so you're gonna press the plus, and then select text. Okay, and here you can type your text. Night VR. Then you can make it larger and smaller and move it wherever you want and then maybe if you want to add a subscriber counter then you're gonna press the plus again select browser okay and here we're gonna paste our URL to our subscribers so for that we need to go into our channel analytics so go to YouTube studio and then press analytics then see live count now you see your live subscriber count so we're gonna copy this and then we're gonna go back into OBS and we're gonna paste this into there so now you see my subscriber counter and if it says something like you gotta log in or sign in or whatever it says you should right click interact and here you can sign in alright so now if I only want the subscribers to be visible I should hold an alt on my keyboard and then drag in these corners so now I, now I have this but there's still a background to it and I don't really want that so for that we're gonna go here have this browser selected and go to filters add a filter and then color key okay custom color and uh, here you're gonna Pick screen color and then go on that and okay now it should be transparent look so now we only have the numbers so now you probably want to stream on YouTube so now we're gonna set that up so you're gonna go here to settings stream and you're gonna want to connect your YouTube account but you can also use a stream key so for that you're gonna go go on onto YouTube press this and then go to go live and to go live you have to go into OBS again and press start streaming that's automatically gonna connect you to this and yeah that's basically how you stream by the way you also got to have 50 subscribers to be able to stream on YouTube so just be aware of that all right this was basically the whole thing if you like this video make sure to hit the subscribe button tell me if y'all want a tutorial on how to go live on your phone next but I hope you all have a great day and see ya